First at four, baseball is back. It's opening day, and a steady stream of fans have descended on the world's oldest ballpark to see their Red Sox take on the Orioles in the season opener. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kayla Fish. And I'm Sarah Grinelli. That game is still underway right now. Our Shannon Heggie and Sam Knox have been up in Boston all afternoon taking in the sights and the sounds. They join us live. Hey, guys, how's it going out there? Hi, Sarah and Kayla. You know, Tony said brisk and chilly. Let's add windy into that. Uh, the wind is what's really making it difficult out here, but the sun is shining. This is tradition for so many people who come to Fenway Park for opening day here. It absolutely is. And of course, the game, what people are here for, 8-2 to two currently right now. The Orioles lead a lot more groans than cheers. However, staying positive. I know, right. I know Boston fans have a tough time staying positive when things aren't going so great, but we saw some great things today. That's right. You guys mentioned the sights and sounds, but also the smells, the aromas of opening day is so synonymous with Fenway Park with the Red Sox. And of course, that includes sausage and peppers. We met a gentleman named Bob Cates. He's been doing sausage and peppers outside of Fenway Park for 25 plus years, and he's from Foxborough, and he gave us kind of an inside look. Take a look. All right, so we're here with Coast to Coast Sausages, and Bob Cates here has been doing this for how many years, Bob? 25 years now. 25 years. This isn't his main job. And the cart has been here for 33 years. The cart? The cart, <laughs> where we park the cart. Do you think you're gonna get more people on a day like this where it's a little cold and they need some comfort food? The out crowd will be the big, biggest crowd always. Coming when when they mean? come out of there, they've had a couple beverages inside, we'll say, and they're they're hungry. You're going to let me serve some sausages? All right, Sam Knox is going to hold on to the microphone. All right, let's go. It's hard not to dive in here. All the goods, all the goods. Good enough. Piece of paper. She's a pro. And let them know that they're ready. All right. Sausage up. Sausage up! <laughs> <laughs> See, I know how to project. Uh, yeah. <laughs> now, and, you got to try that. I did. It was fantastic. She whipped it up in about 10 seconds. <laughs> And I think they were about to offer her a job on the side. I thought it was going to be alone here. He'll be busy when people come out of here. Yeah, They'll exactly. They'll want that warm sausage and peppers after freezing inside the stadium. Yeah, yeah. So right now, the Eight, Red Sox yeah. are down. 8-2 to two is the score right now. However, positive. We're going to stay positive. Stay positive. And coming up at 430, we're going to tell you about some guys who made the trip from up north. They don't think it's that cold out. They don't. And it's actually shocking. Yeah. But until then, we're live in Boston. Sam Knox, I'm Shannon Heggie. Back to you guys in studio.